Good afternoon, I'm Charles Lejano, and this is One News Now. Another member of the Parohinog family died last Sunday morning inside the BJMP facility in Ozales City. The jail nurse found Melodina Parohinog Malingin dead in the ICU almost 12 hours after she was taken to the hospital due to gastrointestinal disease. Malingin died of cardiogenic shock just two days after her younger brother, Ardot Parohinog, succumbed to cardiac arrest in his detention cell at the Ozami City Police Station. Justice Secretary Minardo Guevara has ordered the NBI to look into the reported deaths of Malingin and Parohino, particularly on the state of their health before their demise. Both are siblings of former Ozami's mayor, Aldong Parohino, who was killed in a drug raid in 2017. The Santo Nino de Praga Parish in Antipolo has opened its drive through communion service to the public. For now, the drive through Eucharist will be available from 10 a.m. to 11 a.m. every Sunday. Reverend Father Luisito Atanasio says this is for church members who want to receive communion after attending virtual Masses. Over the weekend, the church reopened its doors to Mass goers for the first time since Rizal Province was placed under MGCQ. But entry to the church is still limited to a handful of people as officials strictly require physical distancing, thermal scanning, and the accomplishment of contact tracing forms for all visitors. PhilPost has released special superhero postage stamps to honor teachers for this year's National Teachers Month celebration. In partnership with the Education Department and the Metro Bank Foundation, PhilPost unveiled the My Teacher, My Hero National Teachers Month special stamps today. The stamps feature four different animated characters presented as superheroes being fed by students. 20,000 pieces of four designs have been printed and will be sold at 12, 14, 15, and 17 pesos each. Aside from unveiling the limited edition stamps, PhilPost also launched its annual Salamat Po Teacher Letter Writing Advocacy Program. This aims to bring back the passion for letter writing among the youth and to develop their composition skills. For more updates, visit News 5, the Philippine Star and Business World Online. Visit our website, onenews.ph, for more in-depth analysis. And you can also catch One News on the Signal Play app. Register for a free account now at www.signalplay.com and stream One News live anytime, anywhere. I'm Charles Lejano. We are One News.